Ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to talk about uh, a new feature in React called Lazy. Okay, basically, you can now you can lazy load components in React, which is pretty cool. Um, I was waiting for this feature for a long time, and now it's finally here. And it actually brought some interesting other features as well. We're going to look at it. So I want to keep it a surprise, and it's really fun. And welcome to TechSeed Tutorial. So those people who don't know what lazy loading is, it's exactly what it sounds like. Uh, instead of loading everything at the same time, you can load something asynchronously, a piece of uh, a page asynchronously. Uh, so your page is rendered while the other pieces are loading. Okay. Uh, if you notice, like uh, if you have a table, and if you scroll up and in and some tables it lazy loads the the rest of the the rows as you scroll uh, they're often lazy loaded right uh, in order to use that feature you need to have react version 16.6 .6 or later um, and i'm using this create react app which is the latest version so i'm fine so i'm going to first build a component that we're going to lazy load and it's going to be a very simple tutorial so uh, we can we can move really fast all right, so let's create a folder called uh, components and inside we're going to have my component.js. I could not come up with a better name, so I'm going to name it my component. And let's import React. And since it's a simple component, I'm just going to simply export uh, default. It returns a very simple div with hi there i am now loaded okay it's gonna say this all right now let's use this component inside this import uh, my comp from from where from components and my comp okay and let's use it very simple right all right so now let's start at least see what's what it renders all right, voila, now it renders this great text called, hi there, I am now loaded. Now, nothing special, right? Nothing really special. Let's try to load this component. Let's lazy load this component. So the sy syntax is, I'm gonna also keep this so we can see the difference. Syntax is my component. Uh, I would need few things. So I would need here, uh, lazy from React. So I can say lazy and inside I would have an arrow function which will import same thing, component slash. So the syntax is pretty simple, but instead of uh, this import uh, syntax, we would, uh, we would have a callback function which, which lazy load. The now if I try to render it, it gives me an error. You know why? Because when I when I render this page, uh, my component supposed to be lazy loaded, which means uh, it actually happens while this page is loading, uh, and often after this page is loaded. Okay, and when this page is loaded, this page doesn't know what my component because it's not loaded yet. Okay, so that's a problem. So how to solve this problem? Well, there is a suspense. So we would have to import another suspense capital s now what this is suspense does is it will to render something while our component is rendering okay so let's say if i wrap the entire page with suspense okay there's too much suspense here now the suspense has to have some something to render so it has a prop call fallback not back wall. <laughs> okay, uh, which could be a component. But here I'm just gonna say div and I can say loading. Okay, that's all I need to do. Okay, I need to actually take this one out so there's no duplicate. If you notice, well, let me make it short or smaller. If you notice, 
it loads really quickly and there's a loading here if you notice okay uh, because this component is it's very lightweight it loads really fast obviously and plus my internet might be really fast luckily okay if I want to see it um, what I have to do is uh, throttle my internet speed and <clears throat> here inside the network tab I have uh, throttling available so right now I can say disable online fast 3g and I'm gonna pick slow 3g okay all right so on slow 3g I can clearly see now loading and then it loads it okay uh, but what if I have something here right uh, let's say I might have something here another component right uh, for that here nothing actually loads until that this component loaded right so what I want to do is I want this to be loaded first and then when this is available this should load while this is loading it should show loading here right so I should actually wrap the suspense only my component let's format this document okay all right so now if I re-render if you notice now there's another component and then there is a loading and when the component that I'm lazy loading when it's available the loading goes away so that's the suspense basically while the component is not available it falls back on this um, component that is provided okay so this is in nutshell how lazy loading works okay and i'm going to upload this code on the my github so you can check it out uh, the link should be in the description and if this is the first tutorial you looked at on react uh, i have bunch of other tutorials a whole series of it and you can check it out uh, i'll provide a link here and i hope you learned something new from this uh, video and if you did please like don't forget to like uh, like subscribe and comment and you can help this channel via patreon uh, i'll provide a link here and you can also translate this video for me to your native language this is very important uh, i'm always looking for people to translate okay uh, so uh, people from your country or your region can also learn it's very simple uh, the instruction should be in the in the description and if you did do and if you do decide to translate please email me and uh, so that i can approve it and i can give you credit in the next video thank you